The traditional method to create a smooth surface for an object in Blender is to use this Shade Smooth option. But sometimes, you'll find that it does not work correctly. For example, if we apply the Shade Smooth option for this cylinder, we discover that the surface now got smooth, but these edges completely lost their sharpness. As a result, the cylinder looks very strange or funny. So we'll discuss on the solution part in this tutorial. But this same method may work for some other objects. For example, let us take this sphere and then apply Shade Smooth. It will make the surface very smooth. And it looks good from all angles. It works in this case because there are no sharp edges for this sphere. Whereas for the cylinder, it fails because there are sharp edges, but we can easily fix this issue for any object. First ensure that you have applied the Shade Smooth option. Then go to this tab called Object Data Properties tab. Scroll down to this section called Normals and expand it. You'll find an option here, which is Auto Smooth. If you enable this option, the sharp edges will come back for your object. Now this has very smooth surface, and the sharp edges are also retained. Perfect! So you can use this method for any object, where you want to quickly make a smooth surface. Let us see this now for this cone. It has got some unsmooth surface here, which we want to fix. We'll apply the same method for this, so let us enable the Shade Smooth option. It will rectify the surface, but you have some problem on the edges, they lost their sharpness. This gives an abnormal look, which is not really correct. So we have to enable this Auto Smooth option. The sharpness will come back and it will look like a normal cone, as it should be. So Auto Smooth is a nice feature, which you can use along with Shade Smooth, if Shade Smooth gives you an undesired result. You can also control the Auto Smooth effect, by using this angle, we'll now look at one such example. Let us first clean the viewport, by deleting all these objects. Now go to the Add menu, and let us add one, Monkey, to the viewport. We can reposition it little bit. There are many ways to make it smooth, but we'll discuss the Shade Smooth option, which is also non-destructive in nature. It will help if you enable the Solid View mode, since the surface topology will be more clearly visible here. Now go to the Object Data Properties and enable the Auto Smooth option. The monkey will now get a smooth appearance, and you can control its behavior by changing this angle. As you increase or decrease this angle, you'll get more or less amount of Auto Smooth effect, since this angle works as the threshold value. If you make it zero, the smoothness will completely vanish, and it will look very flat. So you can experiment with this angle, and set a value that works best for your model. But please remember that Auto Smooth or Shade Smooth does not modify the actual geometry of the object, it only works on the visual appearance. If you want to modify the actual object so that it always appears smooth, you have to use a different method, with an edge split and some subdivisions, which we have discussed in another tutorial. The link is given below in the video description, you can check that. But for all other cases, Auto Smooth can be used very effectively. So, I hope you like what we discussed today. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to this channel.